This is the Sintra. It's about 26 kilometers away from Lisbon. And there's a few, there's a Moorish castle at the top of the mountain, which the plan is to go up there. This is my morning walk, walking in the area around our the Airbnb that we're staying. We decided to not rush going around this mountain. I think a lot of people, if they come up for a day trip, and they take the different buses or vehicles around this mountain. We've decided to spend the whole day and try to walk it instead of taking buses. And this is my morning walk. If any of you have been to Cody, that's in South India. It's a hill station about 2,000 meters up. This place has a similar feel. The, these, this um, wall we're seeing right next to us is very similar to the walls you see in Cody. They're made out of clay, but the tops are always pointed like this one. And they usually put concrete on the top there, so it sheds the water. This tiny cobblestone road I think it's designed for one-way traffic, but I've seen I think cars going in both directions. One of the things I wish this place was less car-driven and more walking friendly. There are roads here that's just impossible to walk. There's so much traffic. This is where I like how Japan does things. They'll take a mountain place like this and they'll have trains and trams that will get you up and lots of walking opportunities. And you get it, trams and trains going up, it's so much more quieter. Yeah, I think you get more people coming up. A lot of uh, tuk-tuks and auto rickshaws around here too and they're the electric ones are nice because they're quiet, but the other ones are two-stroke engines. Noisy and cause a lot of air pollution, I think. It doesn't make sense.